Hey XT, here's your devotional thought for today. Uh, we read the second part of the woman at the well. Here's the cool thing about that, is that after she has this moment with uh, with Jesus. She goes and tells everyone about him. She goes to the town and she tells her relatives, tells friends, tells everyone. That creates a buzz. It creates an excitement. And they they actually believe in Jesus without ever having met him yet. So they go and they follow her and they encounter Jesus Christ. And that is the changing point. Not the moment of her telling them, although that creates the scenario. It's actually them going and them encountering Jesus firsthand. The same thing happens with the official son. The official hears about Jesus and goes to him. She, he first hears that he's in the area, has heard about the miracles, and then he goes to him, and that's when his life gets changed. That's what I want you guys to think of. It's not up to you to have the right answers for somebody when you're talking with them about Jesus. It's not up to you to fix all their problems. It's not up to you to address any of their big issues in their life. All you gotta do is tell them about what Jesus has done for you. That creates the invitation for them to come and meet Jesus, and that's when the life change happens. So today, we're gonna to pray that you have boldness and that you have an opportunity to invite somebody to meet Jesus how you met Jesus. Let's pray. God, I thank you so much for today. I thank you for every NXT student. Lord, I ask that you would create scenarios, divine appointments, where they can share their testimony, where they can share what you have done in their lives, and that because of that, there'd be an excitement that is stirred up in those who are hearing that. And Lord, they would come and know you. Their lives would be changed just like those townspeople, just like those Samaritans uh, that came out to experience Jesus because of the testimony of the woman at the well. Lord, I ask you to empower NXT. You would empower them to speak and be bold in everything that they do. Pray this in your name. Amen. Love you guys.